My name is Devin Clegg and I am the producer of Toaf and Her magazine. Toaf and Her was started I think a little over six years ago. It started with just Chris coming with the idea of like, I want a new creative outlet, I'm thinking of starting this fashion magazine. Um, it started off as a lookbook. I really wanted to share like a complete look with the world, like this is how I like to style my clothes. It's a fashion, entertainment, passion project put together by a group of individuals looking to have a creative outlet. I was going to forego this issue because there was just a lot more that I felt was more important than making an issue, but uh, things changed. While we're being canceled for taking care of the kids and trying to raise the kids and be a normal family, but we're the ones getting canceled because we're the ones who left an abusive relationship. We're the ones who left the abuse to come here to be safe. And I'm the one who's the single mother paying for everything. Just frustrated. Today was a hard day. Why was it a hard day? She basically has PTSD from when we were in Korea. And then he just screenshotted it and posted it and said that you aren't the only one with the legal team pull a clown face laugh emoji. Yeah, dude, no, he's a dick. This is a psychological war. No, and she's screaming, she's saying someone was at my window. So when I went out there, nobody was there. But it's like, why would somebody just make this? Why would a child just make this up? With Chris taking on two children that are, are coming from a situation of abuse, my biggest thing is, is, is happiness because I know Chris is so loving and caring. I have someone that I'm in love with, that I'm with because we love each other, not for any other reason. And it's someone who is kind to my children, who deeply care for my children, and that's all I ever wanted my children to have, was someone to love them as much as I do. When you really get to know somebody and you see them in public, you could see almost their true colors. Like, but with Devin, you know, I saw her motherly love for her children and you know, just how kind of a person she is with everybody. I know deep down inside the true story. I know they're just normal people. They're my best friends. I try to just remind them at the end of the day, like, these people don't know you. They're just trying to get attention themselves. Like, don't let the hate get to you. Um, and know that the people close to you really know the truth and, and are happy with where you're going.